trip to Armagh was a trip back to his childhood for Hollywood actor Sam Neill. The star lived in the city as a child. He began his school days there. Well, this is, this is, you know, this is the first place I went to school. My first school was Armagh Girls High School. But Sorry. don't tell anyone that. <laughs> I promise I won't. Yes, keep, keep it between us. That was around six decades ago. Yes, when it was a little sleepy, peaceful place. And, and uh, it's nice to see it peaceful again and uh, probably not as sleepy as it was then. And has he seen any changes? Um, what I like are the things that are just the same, and it's, you know, the, the mall is one of the most beautiful city centres of any city in the world, I think. It's lovely, peaceful and gorgeous. And you'll remember the jail? That's going to be turned into a four-star I don't think I was, I was ever in jail, but uh, I don't remember that part terribly well. You might have passed it. <laughs> I did pass it, yeah. <laughs> and it's going to be a four-star hotel, it's grand, yeah. Yeah, will you come back for that, do you think? Uh, as long as it's, as long as I have to pay for the privilege. You might, you might even stop your wine, who knows? Yeah, as long as it, I'm not there at the Queen's pleasure. Although the star of Jurassic Park and Dead Cam was looking forward to dining in Armagh's newest restaurant, the Moody Boar, he had some duties to perform. He was here to promote his own wine, which he produces in New Zealand, where his family moved to from Northern Ireland when he was still small. My day job, obviously, is I'm an actor, but I also have been producing wine for about 20 years, and um, so this is the first time I brought it to Northern Ireland. And we're a very small producer, and I live in New Zealand, so it's New Zealand Pinot Noir from central Otago. I've always loved wine, and. Um, and I've always, and for the last 30 years, I've been very interested in Pinot Noir. I started, you know, by looking at Burgundy, and then Burgundy is a great wine to drink. And then it turned out happily that uh, where I live in Central Otago has turned into an excellent place to make Pinot Noir. That's a very unusual thing. It's a difficult wine to grow, and it's a you can only grow it in very small little pockets around the world. And, I live in one of those. Yeah, and will you have your own wine with your dinner tonight, do you think? I'm not sure. Will I? We'll be, we'll be, we'll, yes, we will. We'll be drinking two paddocks tonight.